back in 2008 when the American Recovery and Reinvestment Act came out. There was money for early learning councils and Maryland made family engagement a big part of the early learning councils. So this is a state that really has prioritized family engagement with all the funding sources that it's been able to get. This is something that's now organized through a family engagement framework with very specific goals and strategies. And now moving forward, we're gonna see a state that's gonna be implementing that framework. That's something that our district has been looking to develop for itself, but now we see that MSDE has already created that tool that we can simply tap into. So the framework, there's a, a number of different pieces to it. The main part of it is the goals that the state is trying to achieve through family engagement, everything from creating stronger parent-child relationships to helping parents support child as, a, as their first teacher to creating parents as stronger advocates for their children's education. I think family engagement was um, something that I didn't really grow up with, especially in my early school years. So I think that putting it towards my kids and getting them school ready. I think it's something I really gained and valued. I think we need to see more of that collaboration if we truly want to get families involved. Because to a family, to a parent, they don't care what agency you're with, whether you're with Johns Hopkins, whether you're with the school district, whether you're with this division or that division. They just want everyone to be on board to help their child maximize their success and growth. Part of what Maryland wants to do now that they have the framework in place, the strategies in place, is to see how well it's working. How do you take all of the great work that's happening at the federal level in national organizations, within the Department of Health and Human Services, and somehow accumulating it and pushing it out to practitioners and parents in a way that will help them. We have this great kindergarten entry assessment in Maryland. We can be using to see how outcomes are improving as a result of these new initiatives. We are always looking for opportunities to bring our families together, to work to make sure we're meeting all of their needs. Our motto is we meet our families where they are with no judgments. So we want to educate our families about the resources, but we also want to give them tools that they need in order to be successful, in order to be self-sufficient. Family engagement is not easy. I think one of the big issues is how do you use technology to overcome a lot of these barriers. Parents are very busy, there are communication issues, language barriers, and you know we're going to start using technology both to push messaging messages out to families where they don't have to physically be at the program and also to help translate different messages that the practitioners might need to get out to families. So there's a lot of opportunity for that and that's a big part of the, the next step of the evolution of Maryland's family engagement.